People at the oceanfront are still cleaning up after a tornado rolled through on Thursday. And now that more storms are moving through, you can believe they're a little nervous. Only Chopper 10 can show you what was left behind. These pictures all too familiar from the last week. This is the resort area around 17th Street. 10 of your size, Nita Blanton, went back there today and talked with storm survivors. Anita? Tom and Nicole, I'm glad that the weather has held up at least until today for the folks that live along the oceanfront to do as much work here as they can. They had a lot to do, but by no means are most of them finished with all they need to do. And for some, it's still sinking in that a tornado really did happen. These are some of the latest images from last week's storm just released from Virginia Beach Police. They show the heavy rain near Pacific Avenue that Michael Marshall remembers. And we were all just sitting outside and watching the storm, and it just started pouring, pouring really, really hard. The wind left many in the dark, and daylight revealed the damage to Michael's van. So this wind came through and brought all the rocks and busted out all the windows. And while he and his neighbors taped up windows here, across the street, the workers at Half Moon Music were boarding up theirs because of the same. All the windows just, like, started to shake. The building started to shake and all the windows just exploded, basically. Clean up all around has been a task. Day of, we just tried to like pick up all the glass, vacuum the store, um, try to clean up as most as we can outside, push everything to the street. Today, we found crews picking up debris on the streets of neighborhoods. Insurance adjusters were getting estimates on some roofs. Others, like this one at Star of the Sea Catholic School, still have tarps as bids come in. Uh, part of the roof in the gym, there's a whole part of the roof was ripped up on the end of the gym. We lost about seven windows. But Catherine Wisman says these are all things that can be fixed or replaced in time. After encountering two women injured in the storm, she's thankful things weren't worse. They were in the shed um, in the parking lot and it was picked up and blown over to 16th Street with them in it. It's added perspective even as people continue to make repairs. Uh, those two women that she was just talking about are said to be recovering from their injuries. By the way, school starts at Star of the Sea Catholic School in a little over four weeks. So they're hoping to have all the work to the gym that was damaged by the tornado done by then. Anita Blanton, 10 on your side.